In Toronto Volunteer Fire Department hosted a training this weekend, allowing those from other departments to participate. The classroom and hands-on learning was put on by Box 1971, a fireman education program. 7 News reporter Ashley Kaiser got to see the training firsthand. Firemen from different departments have traveled to the city of Toronto to continue their training and learn from Box 1971. The training took place all weekend, where those firefighters attending would undergo a variety of drills and tests. Box 1971 uses the crawl, walk, run method, constructing their class with the progression of skills to full gear, noise, and pressure. So in 2015, myself and Phil Laramore, who survived 9-11, he's an FDNY retired member, we co-founded this business because we saw a deficiency in training. Uh, our self-imposed mission is to change the culture of the fire service one fireman at a time. So we take that very seriously. We're here in Toronto today training with a bunch of agencies and what we're doing is basically reinforcing the basic skills that we are taught as firemen, but we're taking that to a next level to make and simulate realistic world conditions. Philip Larimore, co-founder and lead instructor of Box 1971, says the American Fire Service is getting weaker and weaker as the years go by. He says technical firefighter skills are not what they used to be. The purpose behind their training is to improve in those areas in which they lack, and he says the three-day intensive really does just that. I have seen that the firefighters who who have come to th this weekend school have drastically improved. I've really noticed that since yesterday morning, compared to yesterday morning and today, it's almost like going from kindergarten to the 10th grade. They've really done well. Laramore spoke Saturday evening about his 9-11 experience and the historical background. His advice in his presentation was to appreciate every second you have and encouraged everyone to call and tell their family they love them. The drills and skills that they're learning inside right now are so that they're able to take on anything that comes their way. Reporting for 7 News, I'm Ashley Kaiser, working for you. Ashley, thank you. And Lara Moore says it's his personal mission to honor and remember all those firefighters who died on 9-11 by making sure those who come after them are trained well and represent the fire service well.